Hi there, this is Saktivel welcoming you all to Number Royale. Today's round three, or day three of our tournament. Welcoming Birdie Flurry, Shruti VVS, Prakash M, Parni, Harita Shri, Kuku, Beard Boy O1, Ratna MJ, Numbers Guy, Raghavi, Toast, Scrappy 434, Srinath 17, Berlin, Srinidhi, and a whole lot of others. Welcome to each and every one of you. So today's rules are fairly simple. We're gonna have 20 of you who are still in the tournament are going to advance today and also in the process earn 10,000 points. And uh, today's match is distinct. So remember that you have to give the correct answer and make sure that your answer is not likely to be matched by somebody else. If there's only two answers, you don't have a whole lot of choice. You just pick the one that is less likely to be given by others so you can get more points, all right? Remember, top 20, move on. So before, no, no lives allowed in this uh, tournament. So we've taken care of that. And I hope uh, it's just uh, makes it, it's a level playing field for everybody. And uh, remember, you're not getting eliminated anyway. Uh, we're just going to have five rounds. So today is round three. Tomorrow is semifinals and then finale on day after tomorrow. All right. So, and tomorrow we will add three wild cards into the picture. So they get a shot at it also. So continue to play. Even if you are not, uh, you've been eliminated in the first three rounds, you can still get back in. All right. So before we get started, a small word riddle. I am a term used to confirm. I am a term used to confirm, but take away my front, my face. I become known as human avarice. Who am I? I am a term used to confirm, but take away my front, my face. I become known as human avarice. Who am I? Tree, if you take away T, you get R-E-E. -E, so that doesn't do it. And Hanto is in an agreeable mood, says agreed. Toast says Sailor Moon. I'm not sure what uh, he or she is going for, but Hanto wins this prize. He got it right. It's agreed. It's a term used to confirm agreed. You take away the front, you take A away. It's greed. That's human avarice. Uh, so that's, that's all it is. So simple word puzzle. Glad you all got it. And let's get started with question one, round three. Seven, six, five, and the desired result is six. Eight possible solutions, and you need to find out which one is unique. Is it? Uh, I don't know whether anybody is going to get a unique answer. There's eight possible solutions, so there may be others who are jumping on the same answer. 36 is the leading point getter. It was five minus six is minus one, and then seven plus minus one is six. So that gets 36 points. Only seven out of eight solutions given. The leaders are 36 and uh, others are not far behind. Lowest points only 28. All right, so let's take a look at question number two. Two, eight, and five. The desired result is 26. All four operators are available and four possible solutions. And I know you're going to knock this one out of the ballpark. Everybody's going to get it. But which one of the solution, four solutions are you going to pick? And are you going to get more points than the others? So it's a little bit tricky. 33 is the maximum point. That's 2 times 8 plus 5, which is 2 times 13, gets you 33 points. The lowest point getter was only 23. All four solutions are given. And leaders at 69 as we move on to question 3. 3, 2, and 9. The desired result is 33. All four operators available. Four possible solutions. And how do you get 33 from three, three, no, these three numbers? You got 3, 2, and 9. Once again, I'm sure Shruti BVS is bragging. Harita Shri is bragging. And you got, I'm sure you got it. It's just that which solution did you pick? 2 plus 9 is 11 times 3 equal to 33 gets you 32 points. 
and 26 is the lowest point. All four solutions are given. The leader is at 99 at question three. Let's take a look at question four. Decimals, the chance to get maximum points for everybody. There are 60 possible solutions to get 3.95 by adding or subtracting these four numbers. 8.2, 10.3, 8.25, and 2.2. How are you going to get it? Be your own man, woman, boy or girl and get your right hand you know unique answer you can get a lot of points so let's see how we do it 28 of you have gotten the correct answer the range is not really that much it's only 37 is the high and 33 is the lowest point leaders at 136 and 12 possible solutions out of 60 are given and let's take a look at question 5 17 13 6 and 18 all four operators are in play. Desired result is 96. Just four possible solutions. And I'm thinking, how do I get 96? I'm thinking, is it six times 16 or is it something else? I don't have a clue and waiting for you to have answered and tell me how you all did it. Is it six times 16 or something else? Oh, it's 24 times four. So that's the key. You do 6 plus 18 is 24, and 17 minus 3 is 4. 4 times 24 is 96. We get 35 uh, is the maximum point getter, and the lowest is only 34. So everybody is pretty much in the same ballpark. Only seven players got the right answer, though. It was a little bit tricky, right? 24 times 4, you don't normally think a big number and a small number. That seems to uh, get you into trouble. Let's see what question 6 brings in. 85 is what we are looking for. Four solutions, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Two, 15, 13, and eight. 85, how do you get 85 out of these things? And I was looking at, is it five times 21? And anxiously waiting to see what you all did. I hope you all got it. 10 of you got it right. Leading point getter is 35. Lowest point is 30. The leader is at 196. Oh, it's 5 times 17. So 15 plus 2 is 7, 17. And then 13 minus 8 is 5. That gets you 35 points. But even if you didn't get the maximum, there's only 3 out of 4 solutions given. You still got 30 points. That's not bad. Let's take a look at the next question. Fractions. Four seventh is what we need with all four operators. Eight possible solutions, five seven, three by two, and six by five. How are we going to get four seventh and with these four operators? It could be tricky. I guess there is some uh, multiplication involved with five seventh, so you get that in the denominator. So that's the. Uh, clue that I can give you, but you've already locked your answers in. 16 of you got it. Oh, 18 of you got it. That's pretty good. I'm impressed with this crowd as usual. You've got 18 of you solving fraction problems in very short time, fraction of a minute. Great job. Maximum's 35, minimum's 29, six out of eight solutions given. Leaders at 231. Remember the top 20 advanced to the semifinals. So let's take a look at question eight. 92 is what we are looking for, 13, 9, 18, and 5. All four operators are in play. You've got 32 possible solutions. And I'm thinking how this looks tricky. I was just doing it 5 times 18, but that gets me 90. And then I don't know what to do with 13 and 9. So, but great. You are solving it. I'm glad you are all much sharper than I am talking and trying to solve it. And let's see how many of you got it. 18 of you got it. Why? This is pretty impressive. 36 is the maximum point. 32 is the lowest. 257 is what the leader has right now. 11, 11 out of 32 solutions are given. It's 13 times 5 is 65 plus 9 is 74 plus 18 gets you 92. And that got you 36 points. Let's take a look at the final puzzle algebra. What values of x and y give you 
three as a desired result, 450 possible solutions. Wow. 4x plus 2y, 3x plus 3y, 3x squared and 2. Just addition and subtraction. And I hope it's an easy one for you. And Haritha Sri is saying lost by, no, there's, you know, there's always a chance. Never give up, right? So let's take a look at uh, where we are and uh, with the final one. 10 of you got the right answer. Seven out of 450 solutions given. 35 was the max, 32 is the minimum. And the leader is a 287. And uh, you are not really out of the tournament because depending on how you scored and your cumulative three days total, you may be able to get in as a wild card. So we'll, you know, we'll tally that for the wild card and uh, make an uh, announcement uh, you know, in your mobile. You will see it, whether you are in or not. Even if you are eliminated, just look, check back in a few hours and see whether three of you would have gotten back in. Right, so let's take a look at who the winners are. So Scrappy434 has scraped and scrapped to the top. Uh, 148 was the point that you needed today to get in the, into the top uh, 20. And I see that there are several of you who are playing who didn't register. So even though if you are not announced as a winner, there is a chance because there are several of them that especially the top three positions, uh, they did not uh, get the, uh, they, they were not registered in the tournament. So that gives their being generous and letting the others play. So let's take a look at the top winner number royal for today is Scrappy434. She's also in the tournament. And so the 287, Birdie Flurry just barely missed the top position by one point, 286. I think he was the or she was the winner for the last two matches. So Virapan it's 283 and Hanto 283 as well. Lash it's at 279. Boy, it's a tough match here. And so congratulations to each and every one of you. Get ready for the semi-final round and wish you all the best of luck. See whether you are able to make it into the top 23 uh, semi-finalists. All right. Let's, uh, this is Saktivel reminding you that without numbers, you're not even a zero. Be a hero, play number royal every day. And uh, I'll say bye for now and look forward to seeing you on the finale. Kamachi will be on tomorrow with the semifinals. Thank you all. Bye for now.